we're about to land, and Millie looks over at me, and she says, Karen, what do you do for a living? I said, Millie, I'm a speaker and a consultant in the area of branding. She said, really? That is what my boss has been doing for 25 years. Millie was from Odessa, Texas. For 25 years, yes, my boss is in branding too. What kind of cattle do you have? <laughs> True story, honest to God. I said, Millie, I said, your boss focuses on the butts. I focus on the brains. Let's look at what, see what Southwest Airlines doing. The first thing from the beginning is they picked a lane. They said, we're not going to be right for everyone out there. And that's a great piece of advice. They own distinct assets. And what this means is, is they picked things that they could do over and over again, that they could either trademark or they could do so consistently that when you thought of a small bag of peanuts and peanut fares, you immediately thought of Southwest Airlines. They coined words. You loved their airlines. No coincidence that they started at Love Field. But so they created a portfolio of distinct assets. So think about what you have in your practice and environment that you could do a little differently, that you could own and be uniquely yours. I help companies and organizations and even individuals try to stand out. So when you think about your brand, sure, you're thinking about it today, how it's going to help you get customers. But if you look into the future, maybe part of your game plan is selling your business. And if you've got a strong brand, you're going to have some more cash in your pocket. So it's not only about today, but it's about the future. So as you step onto your new journey, who will you be? And what will your personal brand stand for? Karen Post is spunky, street smart, and spontaneous. She captivates, entertains, and educates audiences around the globe. It's rare to find a sleepyhead in her audience, unless they just popped an Ambien. Her messages on branding, personal power, and entrepreneurship inspire and activate real change. Karen knows reinvention. She helps brands tell their unique story. She shows organizations how to stand out and find their distinction. She empowers individuals to discover and leverage their inner fire. Engage the folks that matter. Karen combats the challenges of change. Whether you're an industry in turmoil, a company in transition, or you're launching a brand new product, Karen will show you how to optimize change. Ignite personal power and brand you. Karen's a champion of personal power. She believes anything is possible with the right attitude and a good plan. Get your brand back. Karen knows what failure feels like too. She's been in the first cart of the roller coaster herself. Her stories speak to courage and resiliency and help her audiences get back on their game and get their brand back on track. When the media needs a trusted leader with business and branding expertise, they call on Karen for her commentary. Karen's been featured in over 300 news outlets, including the Wall Street Journal, the New York Times, Forbes, and Fox News. Karen's a published author too. She's written two best-selling books on branding, Brain Tattoos, Creating Unique Brands That Stick to Customers' Minds, and Brand Turnaround, How Brands Gone Bad Return to Glory. You go through new employee orientation, there needs to be a big session on what the brand is, why it's important, how did we get here, what is our brand essence, what are our touch points. And then throughout the year, you need to have on-brand employee functions. So maybe part of your evaluation that you do when you evaluate your team members, you throw in a couple brand questions. It's serious stuff. It's not marketing fluff. It's serious stuff. And the final piece to the brand essence is the promise. Now, a promise is not about logical features. A promise is about emotional connectivity. A CPA does not promise to do your taxes. They promise to do a good job so that you get to keep more of your money and enjoy your life. A fashion boutique does not sell warmth and shelter in their clothing. They sell self-esteem. They sell feeling good about yourself. Those are brand promises. Karen's work with top companies from diverse industries. 
Whether you're a Fortune 500 organization, a trade association, or an emerging business, Karen will craft an entertaining and enlightening program so your organization can surpass your goals. If you've got an event that needs to light up and an audience that you need to wake up, give Karen a call. 